Greetings, First Presbyterian Church. I'm standing in the education wing outside of our children's classrooms. It is quiet, quieter than my home right now. Let me tell you though that the church is lonely without you all here. Every week when the staff come into this holy place, the feelings are overwhelming. Though you are not physically here, know that your presence is. That's the beautiful thing about church. We are the church even outside of these walls. This coming Sunday is Mother's Day, the fifth Sunday in the season of Easter. And I'd like to invite you to worship with us on this special day. If you can, set aside some time to worship with us at our usual times of 8.45 or 11 o'clock. Let us join together virtually as a church family. In worship this Sunday, we will be studying the Gospel of John. In the 14th chapter, Jesus said, I am the way, the truth, and the life. In this uncertain time, it is important to be reminded that through Jesus' words, we have been given abundant grace and mercy. In him, we have nothing to fear. For wherever we go, God remains with us. At 9.45 on Sunday, Patrick will, pe Patrick will be teaching the last class in our study from the book, Keeping Hope Alive. This topic is so important when life feels overwhelming. This class is for youth and adults, so feel free to invite a friend and come and engage in this important topic. There are resources for children and families to do faith formation online on our website, as well as youth later in the afternoon. On Sunday, we will be taking a special offering for our ministry partner, Helpmate. Helpmate is an organization here in Asheville, a nonprofit that helps with domestic violence and crisis response. They are a shelter and a center. We've been providing meals for individuals who've been staying in the auxiliary shelter. Another example of the many ways that we are church outside of these walls. I invite you to be a part of these upcoming things tomorrow. In the meantime, grace, peace, and health to you all.